guys. Um, my name is uh, Benjamin Ejumi. Uh, I'm the local chief of uh, Athembo tribe. Uh, my clan is um, Purari Mongori clan, which uh, is the head of the tribe, which is um, the chief uh, of Kokoda. And uh, my job is to, um, uh, every year I uh, bring uh, two Fasi Wasis uh, down to Australia uh, to participate in the Enchic Day to uh, commemorate the friendship and the mateship and the uh, friendship that was established between the diggers and the Fasiwasis during the World War II. As the uh, Fasiwasis uh, main job was to uh, carry the wounded and the dead back to the Australian front lines and also carry all medical supplies and ammunition to the front line and uh, help the Australian to fight and win the war. Yes, the relationship is uh, still strong at uh, this point of time because uh, uh, Australia did not only f uh, fought to win the war for Australia, they also fought to win uh, for our country and give us freedom. And also our people, Fasi Wasis, helped. And it's a two-way thing that uh, uh, help each other to uh, make freedom of uh, what we enjoy as a new generation today in Papua New Guinea and Australia. Yeah, hello, I'm Bill McLennan. Uh, I fought in New Guinea in 42, 43, into 44. Um, I had a lot of association with the Fuzzy Wuzzy Angels, particularly at Buna and in the Markham Valley, where I, was, where I served. And without them, we would have been sunk, I think. That's my personal opinion, because what they that what they did for our fellows was extraordinary, you know. They were they were incredible because what they did for our boys, like with the, particularly the wounded, how they ca looked after them, and they brought in they also brought in food and stuff for us, and they were there if we if we needed them, and nine out of ten times they were there. If it wasn't it was the police boys or something was there with you, you know, 